Hello everyone and welcome back to another video. In today's video I'm going to show you how you can get the new Ashen Guardian Shen skin completely for free in the new season of League of Legends season 13. This method is completely legal and very easy to do. I've been doing it for years and it has been a thing since I started playing League of Legends so if you want to see how I do it then make sure you keep watching the video. However, before we start this video, I'd really appreciate it if you would hit the like button on this video as it would really help push my videos out to a larger audience and helps me see what sort of content that you guys are enjoying and encourages me to make more like it. Sorry, I just hit the microphone. Uh, and on the same note, if you're enjoying what you are watching and want to see more videos like this from me, then make sure you hit the subscribe button and that bell button next to it to be notified whenever I upload. I not only make League of Legends tutorials, but I also make Red Dead Online tutorials as well, uh, Minecraft ones, Hogwarts Legacy, and many more. So if that appeals to you, then make sure you check them out after watching this video, as I'm sure you will find something that uh, on my channel that you will find helpful. Anyway, uh, in this video I'm going to show you exactly how you can get the Ashen uh, Guardian Shen skin uh, and how I did it. So what you're going to want to do is first of all open your lead client uh, and my lead client is going to load up very slowly. So in the meantime I'm going to show you how you can uh, download this application that is completely legal and get the new Ashen uh, Guardian Shen skin. So what you're going to want to do is open any client. Uh, I use Chrome, uh, but you can use anything that you want at all. And you're just going to type in LOL skins. Now, once you click on uh, LOL skins in your browser, uh, you're going to want to go to the leagueskin.net forward slash download. Do not click anything else because I am almost 100% sure. Like, look at that. It looks like it's going to be a virus. It probably will be a virus, so do not click on it. So anyway, click on the one that says leakskin.net. Uh, and if you've gone to the correct website, it will say download mod skin lol 2022. Uh, and it will have a video up at the top. And basically the easiest way to check if you're on the right, uh, correct site is there will be a big orange slash yellow bar up at the top that says leak skin, mod skin, make cover, make avatar, all of that sort of thing. Um, that's my leak client still not loaded up. God, that's a bit scary. Anyway. Once you're on this, uh, you can end up looking through all of, well, basically reading through all of this, but I'm going to show you how you can set it up uh, just through this video. All you're going to want to do is go down to the bottom and you'll see this big orangey yellow button that says download LOL Pro 13.6 here. You're just going to want to click on that. Don't click on anything else whatsoever, just that, because uh, I imagine that any of these ads will probably give you a massive virus on your computer. Now, while this lead client is still loading up, uh, you're going to want to drop this mod skin, this download on it, um, on your desktop. If you don't have WinRAR or something, it will, once you right click it, it will say unzip the file, uh, but on WinRAR it will say extract. So once you put this on your home screen, you'll just want to go to new folder, Type in anything you want, so I'm just going to put in LOL skins, but you can literally put whatever you want, and then just drag that folder in. Uh, leak is slowly loading up, so in the meantime, I'm going to exit out and show you what this client is all about. So once you click onto your folder, you'll obviously get the folder with the mod skin and whatever update it is in your folder. You're just going to want to extract it here, or like I said, if you don't have WinRAR, what has happened with my home screen? Oh, Jesus. Um, yeah, anyway, so if you have, if you don't have WinRAR, it will say unzip file onto such and such, uh, and it will come up with the same thing as you see on the screen now. All you're going to want to do, get rid of that LOL skins or mod skins or whatever it was called, and you'll get left with data.lol, lol pro 13.6, and readme. Now, readme is very good uh, because it will tell you what you shouldn't do, because obviously this is a work in progress constantly. You're constantly going to have bugs, and you're constantly going to have glitches. Uh, and at the moment, custom skins and custom maps are not working. Uh, however, that's not what we're going to be doing or showing in this tutorial anyway. Uh, there we go. League has finally loaded up. Anyway. Uh, like I said, we're not going to be using the custom skins or the custom map skins, so I wouldn't worry about that now. But it's always best to 
go on to the readme before you get into this uh, lol pro client because if you end up choosing a skin and then getting into a game uh, it's going to be very awkward when your skin looks like a big box or a big yellow and black slashes along your screen and whatever telling you that you cannot use the skin and you're going to have to exit out of it swap your skin before you go all the way back in so it's just better to click on the readme and uh, read all of this before you actually get into the client but now enough baffling, baffling on about that all you're going to want to do double click on the lol pro and uh, click yes and it's going to come up with this program uh, title right here uh, you can read through it, but I just click I agree and it's slowly going to open this client up. Now, this client almost looks like a virus as it is. Uh, I know it's very uh, generic 1990s sort of Windows XP vibe, uh, but trust me, this is going, this is not a virus uh, and it is going to change how you play this game. Now, you can choose any skin that you want at all, as you may have seen in my previous videos. Uh, when I've covered this before, you can choose any skin you want. But today we are going to go to the Shen, type Shen in the top right corner, and you will find Ashen Guardian Shen here. Now, you'll just want to click the activate skin here. Uh, it's normally meant to have a picture up here, but uh, let's see if any of these have photos. No, but it seems like that is bugged out at the moment. So yeah, you, this is what we're looking for, Ashen Guardian skin. So you're just going to want to click activate skin here and uh, that is now done. Once again, you can also choose map skins. Uh, however, they're not working at the moment. In future, you can do it, but that's not something that we're going to do. And one last thing that this client can do that I think is quite cool uh, is click. Uh, if you click at the bottom center, you'll see off gold, platinum, diamond, master and challenger. Uh, I obviously go for challenger. And what this basically is, it shows uh, the border around your screen uh, as whatever you choose so when you're loading into the game you'll see that mine will have the challenger border screen but if you want it to be master or diamond or platinum um, then you can do that as well now what i'm going to do is now that i've let me just double click that make sure that i have got the shen enabled uh, i'm just going to go into a custom game for you guys and show you that the shen skin is now working uh, just going to go to start game and unfortunately this computer that i'm running on is very very buggy so uh if it's very slow then please forgive me just going to click on the shen and we'll load into the game as normal and while we're loading into the game i imagine that may take a while because of my slow computer so in the meantime i'm going to tell you exactly why this strategy is not bannable and in fact you can use this for life um Basically, the reason why this strategy has never been banned, this little method, uh, never been banned because it's been uh, a client for as long as I remember League. Uh, it, this is because the way that this client runs is it's taking your default skin on your files in on your computer and changing it with whatever skin you choose. Uh, and because of this, it is changing your client's skin However, it is not changing it for anybody else. So whereas you may see uh, a different skin, everybody else is seeing your skin as normal, which actually means that you're not getting the skin as a technicality. Uh, but to you, you'll see no different. You'll see the skins as normal. Um, and the reason why I haven't banned this, I have made proof of this in the past because I have contacted them about this client to make sure that it wasn't bannable. Uh, and they told me that it isn't a bannable offence and in fact they almost encourage it and this is because if you are using your skin so much your favourite skin so often so for example I love the Blood Moon Diana skin uh, I was using it so often but I knew that I didn't actually have the skin so what I did is I went and bought the skin for real because I knew I enjoyed right. it unfortunately guys uh, my computer is not able to run recording and playing at the same time uh, so you're just going to have to take my word for it that it works uh, but anyway guys i hope you guys enjoyed it and i hope you guys found this video helpful like i said earlier in the video if you did find this video helpful then please click the like button down below and the subscribe button next to it to be notified whenever i upload a new video now anyway guys if you have any questions or you need anything explained in any more detail then please let me know in the comments down below and i'll make sure that i will 100 
uh, percent respond to any of your questions. Anyway, guys, I'll leave it at that and I will see you in the next video. Goodbye, everyone.